at 530 Florida voters just voted to ban Greyhound dog racing by the end of 2020. And that's going to have a big ripple effect. Thousands of Greyhounds that will need homes across the country. And as two on your side, Chef Preval reports, a local group is already getting calls about bringing some of them to Western New York. Florida voters approved overwhelmingly to ban Greyhound racing by the end of 2020. Animal rights groups called for the ban, racetracks opposed it. A state report found that Florida's Greyhound dog racing industry was actually causing the state to lose money. I was stunned that it passed. With the future ban, Greyhound adoption groups such as the Greyhound Action League in Chictawaga have been getting calls about whether they can adopt. We've had a few inquiries about actually adopting a Greyhound. I have um, an owner that has dogs in several states, including Florida, and he has reached out to me. What position has this change now put owners and breeders in, do you think? A real tight spot. Um, it's their livelihood, so basically they've lost their jobs. Is there any optimism because this doesn't officially begin at the end of 2020 and beginning of 2021? We've got about 12 to 13 months, um, but with that being said, there's still a lot of dogs that are going to be um, displaced. Pike says her group may need to drive to the south to pick up greyhounds. So uh, at the end of all this, how many do you think, how many greyhounds do you think you'll be able to relocate? Um, our group alone, um, you know, we're hoping to help with possibly 20 dogs. Where's your heart and your mind going to be at, you know, in this process? Uh, about the dog. It's always the dog first. Now, if you have any questions about adopting, you can reach out to the Greyhound Action League of Buffalo. I've tweeted out a link to their website. Reporting live, I'm Jeff Preval, Channel 2 News.